back to the Loma Colorado Library. Today we're going to create a craft. What we're going to do today is we're going to do a jellyfish. So the first thing you the supplies you're going to need are you're going to need a piece of paper. It could be any color you like. And then you're going to need white or black. If you don't have these pieces of paper, that's okay. The other supplies you're going to need, you're going to need some scissors. You'll need a pencil, a glue stick, some yarn, some crepe paper. If you don't have crepe paper, not a problem. Just use regular construction paper. And then markers if you'd like to add some decorations to your jellyfish. So we're going to start by using our pencil and our piece of paper. What you're going to do is you're just going to draw a circle. So go ahead and do that. Just go ahead and draw a big circle. After you do that, you're going to grab your scissors and cut out the circle. to the side and what you're left with is a nice big round circle. Our next step is going to be the same thing. You're going to grab your piece of white paper and your piece of black paper and cut out more circles. So now you have two pairs of black circles and two pairs of white circles. So now what you're going to do is go back to your blue circle. What you're going to do now is from the center of your circle, you're going to create a line to go to the edge. And then you're going to cut this line. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go back to our black and white circles. These are going to be our eyes. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the black circle, use your glue stick, and glue it onto the white circle. And do the same thing to the other pair. So now you have two eyes. So what you're going to do now is you're going to glue your two eyes onto the blue sheet of paper. Our next step is you're going to grab your crepe paper. If you don't have crepe paper, that's okay. You can use regular construction paper. Just grab a regular sheet and cut out strips of paper. So we're going to cut out strips of paper. I'm going to make mine very short, but you can make yours as long as you want. And that's it. Just do that. You need about five of these little sheets. Once you have this, you're going to grab your glue stick one more time. You're going to flip over where the eyes are, make sure facing the bottom, and glue your sheets to the back.
just like so. Our next step is if you want to have your jellyfish hanging up, you're going to just need a little piece of string. You can make the string as long or as short as you like. I'm going to make mine a little short. And all you're going to do is the same thing we did to connect our blue papers, flip it over so you're looking at it like this, and you're just going to glue your string to the back. After that, we're going to make sure our string goes through the cut we did before. like so. Now we're going to give our jellyfish shape. So you're going to grab the end where you cut it, you're going to overlap it like so, and then you're just going to glue the pieces down. And that's it. That's all the work you have to do. Now you have a hanging jellyfish. Well, thank you for coming. Thank you for joining us in this craft today. We'll see you next time.